John Spark here from Travel with Purpose, and I'm really excited today as I'm going to interview Lee Evanson, the Business Development Manager for Insight Tours. I'll just say a quick hello to Lee. Lee, have we got technology working? Yes, all good, John. All good and live. Yeah, so I can I can hear you uh, loud and clear, which is excellent. Excellent. Uh, it took us uh, 38 minutes, <laughs> but anyway. This is our first ever test on this particular methodology that we're using. So what I'm going to do today is I've got Lee with me, as I said, and we're going to uh, ask Lee some probing questions, six in fact, about Insight Tours. Uh, what we hope to do from the, by the end of this interview is you'll be able to determine for yourself whether Insight Tours could be a fit for you with future travel. and. Uh, so let us kick straight into it, Lee. I'm going to uh, get you to share your screen if you would, and I'm going to ask the first question as your screen comes up. Okay, so that's all share. Can you see that, John? Yes, I can. So let's get this first question. Why does Insight Vacations exist, and what is its main purpose when it comes to clients? Well, that's a good question, John. And Insight Vacations, we, we really exist because we want to open the door to many wonderful destinations throughout the world. When you travel with Insight, our clients have really a unique opportunity to visit a country, but actually to be fully immersed in the destination. And you really do get a chance to actually see and live a destination like you are local. Um, and one of the great things about an escort journey with insight is the premium to a very high standard and we take care of everything so what i mean by that the guests can literally leave their brain at home if they like because the moment they arrive on an insight tour we take care of everything we pay uh, attention to all the little details and we take away the normal stresses that can occur on maybe um, a standard vacation uh, I think there's a lot of people today that are really looking for that so sort of travel. So let's push on and see if we can dig in a little deeper, shall we? What sets Insight Vacations apart from its competitors? And how did you identify this as being important? Well, with Insight Vacations, um, our tagline, if you like, is the art of touring in style. And that really resonates throughout the whole company. Um, in terms of the luxurious methods of transportation that we use, um, also the, our wonderful hotels in, in many destinations as well. But we really do try and take our itinerary to a luxurious level. And, and how do we do that? Well, we do escort journeys in a country by road, rail and cruise. And, and one of the, the types of transport that we use is our um, luxurious coach. Now, on a standard touring coach, you will be having a, a seat capacity of 53 seats, but with Insight Vacations, we thought, what can we do to make ourselves different? How can we make sure that when we are traveling our, our guests from one destination to the next, we just make it as comfortable as possible? So we actually reduced the seats on board. We actually we took 13 seats off and we did a maximum amount of seats to just 40. And what that means is when the guests travel with Insight, it really is like traveling business class on an airline, you know? And the seat pitch is double than what you get on a standard touring company. And also the window space is far greater as well. So the guests can kick back, they can relax. They have modern luxuries um, on, on the coach, like Wi-Fi, which is complimentary and free of charge. And it's just a very comfortable journey from one city to the next. But you never want to coach for more than two hours at any one time anyway. It's just simply a vehicle. But when you arrive at a destination, we also want our guests to ensure the very best in accommodation. So we actually carefully handpick all our hotels, not just to be of a certain quality, but also to be in the right location. This is the gorgeous Millennial Hotel that we use in Venice. Um, when the guests arrive here, their bags are taken to their room, check-in is done for you, so you don't have to worry about standing in a check-in line, and you actually get given a glass of champagne on arrival at this hotel, which is really nice, and it's in the prime spot overlooking the Grand Canal. But we also, moving on from uh, the hotels that we used, we also have what we call 
signature hotels. There's over 80 of these amazing properties throughout um, our brochure range for 2015 and 2016. And this could be anything from one of my personal favorites on here is the beautiful plantation that we use. It's called Monmouth Plantation. It's on our Rhythms and Flavors Tour of America. So if anyone wants to go to a destination and learn about the amazing American history, the, the superb blues music, and, and obviously that Southern hospitality. While we're there, we actually stay in a sugarcane plantation, which is uh, set on 26 acres of land. So our hotels really do um, set us apart as well um, on our tours, um, as well as the the methods of transportation and um, and also the experiences that we include as well. It certainly sounds like uh, you know, you're going for luxury and you're going for comforts. I mean, you know, I've been on coach tours and in years gone by and. Certainly, and it's much like traveling an economy class on an aircraft. There's, there's not much room, but I can, you know, 13 seats removed and, and being able to sit back and having plenty of window space, it's certainly going to give you an element of comfort. And I do like the fact that you never go longer than two hours. I mean, that's, that's kind of yeah. like a long trip, isn't it? One hit. Do any of Inside Vacation Tours stand out above the rest? And who does this appeal to the most? Yeah, we, we understand, John, that, that every single client is, is different and, and not everybody that goes to Europe or to the USA or to India wants the same experience. Some people want different styles of journey. So what Insight and what as a company, what we've had to do is we've had to tailor our itineraries to suit individual tastes. And so we have a range of six different itinerary styles just to suit the taste of every single traveler. Um, we have our amazing discovery journeys, for example. They start primarily in the UK and include the Eurostar to Paris or Brussels. And then you get to visit a selection of countries on one itinerary so that's perfect if you like for that first time to travel to Europe the person who wants to go to uh, Europe for the first time and see the highlights of in each country but then we have different other styles of journey we have easy pace which are a very relaxing itinerary they're a minimum of three nights in each city and you have a lot of free time to do your own thing so great great balance between the guided sightseeing but also having that time away from the group not on the coach just doing your own thing and exploring and again regional experiences focus on a specific region we have country roads that take you off the back roads mini trips and are all inclusive gold luxury tours within europe and india too but um really it, it's hard to sort of pick out a um a one standard tour that that, that um that sort of ticks every boxes, but it's not just um, the, the escorted journeys by road that we use. I said earlier that we do some lots of different types of transport. So I just really want to show you this one because it has proved very popular with our guests in, in 2015 so far. And it really is um, not hard to see why. It's called Dalmatian Elegance. It focuses on a part of Europe, which is in Croatia, which is absolutely becoming the jewel of Europe, if you like. And basically, it's a tour which includes seven nights cruising on a mega yacht around the islands. And you can see, hopefully, by this image on the screen, that the yacht is absolutely immaculate. The boat only takes 38 guests maximum. And we actually cruise um, to these islands uh, where we um, then go onto the islands and we have some really nice onshore experiences like visit wineries, village feasts are put on for our guests. And it's just a really nice, relaxing, glamorous way to travel. And um, I definitely um, one of the hits for us in, in 2015. Oh, I can tell you it would be a massive hit for me too. Actually, Nilla and I are looking at that one next year. It's something that, yeah, the Dalmatian coast is... You know, everybody comes back singing its praise and, and the experience there. And to do it more or less like the rich and famous without paying the same price as the rich and famous on a mega yacht, we're just doing it in your, on the inside yacht. I just, I really think it's going to have some massive leagues myself. What are the most common mistakes people make when considering inside vacations and that you wish they would avoid? 
I think one of the most common mistakes that people think is um, they think maybe when they travel with Insight, it's all about going on a coach tour. And unfortunately, sometimes that does have a certain stigma attached to it. Um, quite clearly, it's not like that when you travel with Insight. Um, the coach is just a method of transport that we use to get our guests from one city to the next. It's the same as using a river cruise or an ocean cruise around the Mediterranean. When you travel with Insight Vacations, it's not about the method of transportation it's about the experiences that we use and we include as part of the trip yeah the coach does give a high level of comfort but it's about what you do when you get to these places say for example here this is the the island of capri on the on the, the southern coast of italy and and while we, we cruise to the island of capri well, one of the best ways to get around is to go out in one of the open top taxis so we do that for our guests we include this as part of the tour and it's just a really nice way for them to relax sit back and see the wonders of capri but we also have amazing experiences included on all our itineraries. 2015 is our signature year. So we have signature events on every itinerary. And it could be meeting this man, Marco. He owns his own olive oil farm in, um, in the heart of Tuscany where he makes his own olive oil, olive oil from scratch. And it's a family um, um, business that's been running for many generations um, and our guests love this they love that we open the door to people like Marco so they can get to see firsthand what it's like to live in a destination and they get to take part in some really nice dining experiences like our dine around evenings where they get to choose from a, a selection of restaurants instead of being told where they're eating and we also take them out in the evening time as well and we include tickets for some amazing events like the the Paleosberg in, in Vienna or of course the Moulin Rouge in Paris and um, now all these experiences are what our guests love and it's one of the, the many reasons why they choose to take a, an escort a journey and uh, I think going to visit the olive oil farm is it, it, fantastic and uh, I believe is, is, is olives are nearly as good as yours and Neil is John. Well that must be good then and um, we actually got a, <laughs> we've got a new crop sitting there right at the moment actually we took the first lot off the tree last weekend and there's some more happening it's actually one of the best crops we've had in uh, a while. We just seem to have had the right weather conditions. And I know what it's like, there's so many different ways to, to make olives. So every olive cure, I guess the word is for them, will do it differently. The, the oil will taste differently based on the soil and the way that they do it and how long they age it. And so, yeah, there's, there's you know, the good thing about that, you can never sort of normally run to two lots of oil that tastes the same, not by quality people anyway. It's fascinating. There's so much detail involved, isn't there? But yeah, it's our, our guests. Guests absolutely love them. Authentic, real experiences. That's what travel's all about. It's it's making. It's opening the door to these experiences for people to enjoy. It's the new future of travel. It, it's hands on. It's getting up close. It's it's touching, smelling, seeing all of the what's local you know, and not driving past it going oh, there's an olive fortune on the farm here and now we're, or olive grove and we're going to uh, call in and grab a bottle of wine from the deli up the road and that's it it's it's about getting yeah. in there and talking to the maker and they're passionate that's the other thing you really learn a bit about their culture their family and the history you never look at olive oil the same and uh, that's you know, or anything for that matter whether it's wines oils food truffles Alrighty, we could go on a little bit, but let's get the rest of the questions up. <laughs> what one thing about inside vacations do you wish clients knew that you feel would ensure their experiences would be the most rewarding? Well, one thing I've, I've not mentioned so far, and, and I've been waxing lyrical, if you like, about Insights features and, and, and what we stand for, but one of the things that I'm really proud of working for Insight Vacations is our reputation you know our reputation within the travel industry and our reputation with our guests you know we have such a high level of repeat clientele that travel with insight year after year and we really do value their custom and our reputation really does show people that we actually put 100 percent into everything that we do and really our 
our guests are at the heart of everything that we stand for within a company and um and we have got the award to back that up we've been giving people luxurious and premium escort journeys for the last 36 years and and during recent years we we won um best international tour operator a record six times you know it's wow. um it's it's an amazing um thing that we're that we're proud to actually have and um and yeah and 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 we 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 understand that when when guests go to travel we one thing that we say to our guests is it's just the just to open their eyes and um and relax and, and we'll take care of everything for them you know and uh they can be safe and nice that they're traveling with a company that has got a great reputation and and our number one goal is is to look after them it is very very important what you're highlighting i mean you, know, you can't win the awards and unless you're delivering firstly and secondly the other component about you know the awards have come because you've just looked after people so well you've understood them you know what they want you know what makes it work for them so when a person does decide that an uh, inside tour is good for them and the experience that they're hoping to obtain then you know they they can be comfortable they can have a peace of mind they can sit there and go you know everything's going to be taken care of it's going to live up to expectations and i, I think you know one of the myth things you mentioned earlier on if you pack your open mind and really enjoy the experience for what it is you know you're going to come back much much richer than what you went so thank you for sharing that lee I, i'm passionate about that as you can tell i always say to people you've just got to have the right mindset and then if you can match that to the right company which you know you were giving us some insights into insights so to speak pardon the pun then you know the, the rest should flow the way you feel it designed to and, and that's kind of where it's about what one question didn't i ask that you wish i did so well yeah what one question well one of the questions uh, was was maybe um, just to speak from my own personal experience. You know, I'm I'm lucky enough to to work for Insight Vacations and to actually travel and experience the the, the product firsthand. And and I I actually went away myself on an Insight tour last year um, to Canada, and um, our tour directors as well. I don't. I think I've given them much air at the moment, but our tour directors are absolutely um, sensational. Um, and I remember our tour director we had on our Grand Canadian Rockies itinerary, and she was French Canadian. She um, she grew up, she was born um, in, in in Canada. She she has so much passion for the destination, and and it really became apparent quite soon that. This person that we were traveling with wasn't just a uh, an employee of the company we we're traveling. They really did become a friend. You know, it was like having a uh, a personal friend with us in a foreign land, and and also like having a hotel five star concierge service too, because she she told us many different hidden highlights of the destination. She took us away from the the main tourist spots and and they really do with their knowledge and their passion and and their dedication to you just they are the the total icing on the cake for, for an inside tour so our tour directors uh, are something that we are fiercely proud of um, as a company and, and something that one of the things i speak with many guests um, even at your recent expo john guests speaking to me who've been on insight tours and one of the things they tell me is they mention the tour directors and and straight away they they they're not they know the name and it's something they don't forget they they really do take take that person home with them thank you lee um one of the uh things that i can guarantee anyone with is that if you get the right company like insight the highlight of the tour is it usually comes down to two things in this order. It comes down to the tour director, the people that they were with, and then finally what they experienced. And that's strange because when they went away, they really wanted the experience first, but it's the people 
that make the experience come to life. It's just too easy to look at something and not understand it. And then somebody brings it to life with their history, their passion, their commitment. A tour director committed to uh, the local area uh, understands that it prospers not just the inside tour people, but it prospers the whole area as people go away and become advocates of you must go and do this at some point in your life. So congratulations to Insight on, on the training that you guys give your team because uh, we love it. Most of our clients who book Insight book a repeat holiday. So that's that's great for us. It's easy. And more importantly, they, they deliver on the experience. So I have no more questions, Lee. I really, really appreciate uh, you giving us the time today to do this. What I'm going to suggest is for those of you watching this, if you've got any questions that we haven't covered and there's bound to be more or less on specific tours, etc., just put them in the chat box and we'll be checking this every single day and I promise you we will get back and answer these questions for you. And, of course, if you uh, want to have a more personalised uh, talk with any of us, because at this point we actually have no idea whether we're even a good fit for you or not. But uh, if you're at that stage already, because that's where you are with your research, then please call us on 1-800-130-635. But I want to emphasise, this is not about you contacting us. This is about enlightening you to what insight can offer, should that be uh, something of interest to you. So again, Lee, Thanks so much for your time this morning. I have uh, no more questions. What about yourself? Do you have anything to finish off with? That's. I think that's it, John. I think we 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 went through the the main points, and it's been a real pleasure. Um, it really has. It's um, it's, a, it's a great opportunity for us just to to showcase what what we can what we can offer off our guests uh, when they when they choose to travel with insight.